Hello, my name is Riley Lewis, and today I'm going to be talking about the discipline of submission. So our focus areas for this presentation today are going to be what is submission, why submission is important, areas that we can apply submission in our lives, and why we should apply submission in our lives. So first with what is submission. Submission is the outward discipline of viewing people the same way that God views us. This could be with um, being humble and open-hearted around people, having a great attitude. It doesn't always have to mean that we are passive or subversive, but that we are able to respect the rights of others and their dignity, while also still maintaining our integrity and our values. So why is submission important? The importance of submission is having the ability to lay down the burden of always needing to have our own way. Submission allows us to change the way that we view other people around us. For example, in 1 Peter chapter 2, verse 19, it says that for this is a gracious thing, when, mindful of God, one endures sorrows while suffering unjustly. In submission, we are free to give up our own views and opinions for the good of other people around us. And here are some areas that we can apply submission in our lives now that we know what submission is. A few big ways that were really helped out with me personally in my life. The first one being gratitude, which is living with a thankful heart. Just being appreciative of what God has blessed us with in our lives. And you can apply gratitude by expressing to God and to others, their contributions and their support, saying thank you for what you've done. This would not be the same if it were if, you, if it were not without you. And next, we move on to humility. Humility is another one that I have used in my life as well, which is recognizing that you are not perfect and can always learn from others. So, humility can be applied by avoiding pride of yourself and. When you are prideful, it can hinder your spiritual growth, so it's very important not to take pride in it as well. And there's actually a story about humility. Humility was something that I struggled a lot with uh, putting into my life. I really took so much pride in what I did and chose to just shrug it off as if I got this. And it took humility for me to finally realize that I'm not perfect, I'm not well constructed. I need people by my side mentoring me on my journey to become more like Christ. I need to continue reading my word, to continue to observe and understand the wisdom that God is teaching me. And I also need to lean in and listen more to my professors and my teachers here at Highlands College and my friends because they have different perspectives, they have their own ideas, and they could be a lot better than mine. So it's always important, and that's a big example of why it's important to take humility in this and seek other people around you to help continue to grow yourself, to glorify God. And the third way in your life that you can use submission is through personal growth. Personal growth opens you up to a bunch of other opportunities in your life because you're allowing people to constructively criticize you, but in a way that develops you into an even stronger Christian in this spiritual discipline. Now, personal growth can apply to um, educating yourself and also seeing information from other people and other resources around you that'll help you grow spiritually. Once you have applied these in your life, then you will see these two things begin to grow in your life. You will begin to find a greater source of purpose in your life when you use submission. Um, you begin to grow in how God has formed you, and you can begin to glorify Him in the same ways that He has created you. And these can really help, not only help out other people around you, but glorify God as well, and continue to spread the gospel to other people. It also improves your authenticity as well. You're able to apply your own version and perspective of Christianity Christianity through God's word and this really improves the way that you see the world around you because you're not constantly having to compare yourself to the way that other people are living their lives.
Here are my scholarly resources that I have cited in my bibliography. And thank you so much for listening to my presentation on the discipline of submission.